Hi YouTube! Um, and I guess some of my Twitter followers, I think those are the people who watch my videos and some of my family members. I'm back in the closet. Not really, because that's the closet. Actually, outside the top of the closet at their little vanity. But, um, what I'm about to show y'all means I have a serious condition. And I, oh look, see I'm not wearing my wig. See, I can see I actually had to pin some of my twists down. Is it sticking out all kind of crazy? Because I wore my wig today. So when I put my wig on, sometimes I don't wear a wig cap. And I just, the twists land however they land. But, um, it's growing. It's nice and soft. But right now, I want to tell you, I have a problem. It's called product junkiness. I, I'm, I'm a product junkie. I finally have narrowed down to what I'm going to use. And I'm going to use it. It says it takes like six months to see if a product's really working, whatever. I'm just going to use it. I'm going to try to pick something and stick with it. So I have. I'm going to pick something. I haven't worked out a when. You know what I mean? I don't know how often I'm going to wash my hair because I don't feel like twisting my hair very often. So, yeah. Hold on, I'm sorry. I'm talking to my friend on G Talk, and I'm very upset with them because... They got mad at me because I banished, aka my battery died, and I didn't have it all day. I was out. So, and then I'm writing to them. I'm like, oh, okay, well, I'm here now. What's up? Let's talk. No answer for an hour. And now all of a sudden, they're like, hey, what's up? Bro, really? Anyway, back to my product junkiness. This is what I've acquired in the year because I'm I I stopped perming my hair in 08 but I didn't I literally didn't start taking care of my hair until I was until last year till March of last year I wasn't doing anything to my hair at all I was braiding it like I would get extensions put in it cornrows or whatever but I wasn't doing anything sorry my camera work sucks <laughs> you just asked me what I'm doing making a YouTube video So anyway, um, I'm going to just scan through, show y'all all the products that I bought recently, last year, a few months ago, just trying to find that holy grail that, oh, for my hair. And I actually have a couple of staples. Literally, here are my staples. Olive oil, water with olive oil, and, um, Lavender oil for the scent of it, but um, and my other one, even though I kind of abandoned it in my hair for a while. Hold on, I kind of abandoned it. Shea butter, these two products, no matter what else, conditioner, or whatever I've been using, I always go back to shea butter and olive oil, especially olive oil, especially olive oil. So, anywho. Um, to the products. Let me show you what I have. Can y'all see? This long row of products. Just a long... It's sickening. It's sick. It's sick. Okay. So, what's really awesome ow, is that I... Ow, I caught my toe in something. Is that I have a cousin who will take some of these products off my hand. Um, let me tell y'all right now. This I was using at one point. has protein. I didn't really like it. I was using this last year. And I finished using it on my grandmother's hair. I've been using this for her hair. And it's working. So this is her leave-in conditioner. I bought this castor oil initially for me. And I gave it to her because I found Jamaican black castor oil before I slept with the Jamaican has nothing to do with Jamal, but um, yeah, I've been using this for my edges, but I'm so inconsistent that it really hasn't been working, because I'll be like, oh, I gotta oil my edges, and then I'll stop, but I seal her hair with this, um, with cast oil, because her hair's really, really thin, she, you know, all the chemicals and blah, 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 so, 
those are actually hers um she has been using i got i got a kit from our well I, from um avon for my birthday last year she bought me a little kit it had shampoo conditioner body wash lotion and all of that and at the time i was strictly cg so i couldn't use the shampoo and conditioner that came in it and i still can't use the conditioner even though i'm not really see i'm not cg at all right now um, because it has a lot of protein. It's banana and coconut milk and a bunch of stuff in there I can't use. So my Nana's actually been using the shampoo and didn't know that it had a conditioner to it. Because she doesn't look for anything. Hold on. But yeah. Shampoo and conditioner. Bam. Those are hers. Her shampoo and conditioner. Um, I'm actually, y'all know about this. This curl enhancing smoothie. I can't use it. It has protein. We just did my cousin Jasmine's hair and twist. And we're going to give her this. It's literally a brand new jar. I'm so upset. I have not been able to use it. Like, it's ugh, it's a wad of hair in here. Thanks. Thanks for not picking out the hair. You know, y'all just use it. Just leave the hair in there. Like, look how new it is. Hold on. It's brand new. Brand freaking new. Haven't used it. So, she can have it. Too much protein in it. It has, um, yeah, with coconut oil, silk protein. Can't use it. Drying out my hair. So, this is actually going to my cousin. Now, let me give y'all what I'm doing right now. This is going to my cousin. Remember, this is one of my staples. This is going to my cousin. This is going to my cousin. I think my cousin's coming up the stairs right now. Jasmine! She might walk in on me taping the video. I might make her tape the rest of this video. Oh, she can't. I have to turn the camera around. Um, I'm giving this to my cousin. And the smaller bottle that I had bought. Because she is strictly CG. And she's actually been using herbal essences as her rinse out and leave-in and deep conditioner. I don't know. And she's been using Suave Coconut as her co-wash. So I told her, here, finish this stuff up for me. You know, use this as your co-wash. Use this in place of herbal essences until you get more herbal essences. So, that's what's happening. I feel like I'm talking really low. I'm sorry. So that's what's happening. I'm actually running out of time um, to tell y'all more. Let me just tell y'all what I'm using currently. I just bought another bottle of it today, too. Jasmine! I keep hearing people. Oh, God, I'm freaking myself out. Um, I just started using it the last Monday. The Cantu line. Shampoo and the moisturizing rinse out conditioner. I, it's the summer, so I put honey in this as a humectant. In the shampoo, it actually has honey. So I added my own honey to the conditioner and um, olive oil and I bought another bottle just because I'm in Delaware and there's no tax so that's what I'm using that shampoo that conditioner I'm gonna finish off this Aussie three minute miracle it has jojoba in it and I can't use jojoba oil right now because of the whole protein overload thing I'm learning guys I'm learning but I'm gonna finish this up and then after I finish that up, I'm going to be using this as my deep treatment, my deep conditioner, the Shea Moisture Deep Treatment Mask. And um, always have my olive oil, my shea butter. I'm not even showing y'all shea butter. Um, what else? My castor oil. That's going to be with me. I'm finishing this up finally. I think I'm done with it. Yeah, I can toss it now. The Giovanni Direct Leave-In. Toast. It's done. I had it for a year. Five, no. It's 2011. I had it for two years. Yeah. Like two years? No, no, no. A year. So, finally finished it. Um, I thought I didn't like it, but it was because of all the protein in all my products. I, felt, I thought this was the problem, but it wasn't. Because this doesn't even have protein in it. But, um, I'm done with this. So, I'm not using this. I'm technically not going to have a leave-in. After I shampoo, condition, deep condition my hair, I'm going to go straight to the Carol's daughter.
and start twisting my hair. And as 